How long has it been since I've done this? Too long. Too... Long? I have no idea what's going on here right now. Chloe, you're alive, yes! Whoa, whoa, down, Max. You get one kiss, now you're all over me? I'm just... I'm just, I'm so glad you're here. You sound high, but thanks for the morning grope. Since we were up all night playing CSI Arcadia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. Max, did you forget we've gone over this? I hope you weren't messing around with time while I was sleeping. Not anymore. I'm just spaced out too. Welcome back to the real world. Oh, okay, Let's yeah. Let's look at the big board and see all our pieces in the puzzle so far. Ladies and gentlemen, not the internet. My name is Ben, but you can call me the Bad Light. Welcome back to Life is Strange. Oh, this is awesome. Um, for those of you that are lost in all this shit. Okay, okay, easy. Jeez, come back to like months later, and Chloe is still pissed off at me. Great. Exam. Thank you. You know, professional YouTuber. Whatever, right? So close, yet so far away. We have to do three main things. Right. Um, uh, what things? Exactly, I'm lost too. One, decipher Frank's logbook. Two, Get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Three, beat Step Douche Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the Dark Room. And I do have a gun now. Keep it in your pants. We'll have to do this on our own. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. <sighs> Fine, whatevs. It's your power. Which I can't waste on shit like that. Blackwell would be in big trouble. You didn't even let me take that money to pay Frank off. And I'm glad. We have to be better than that. I know. You should get busy in the garage to see what dirt you can dig up. I'm gonna cyberstalk some names and see where that leads. Or to who. And be careful of Stepcrack. He's not gonna be a happy camper after you reamed him yesterday and Mom is giving him the boot. I'm on it, partner. That's right, we're messing with time. I can't abuse this level of my rewind power. It's way too dangerous, and I need to navigate the present without messing up the past. This butterfly photo seems like a million years ago. How much time have I altered since? I don't know. How much time can you take back? That is a good question, even though we've already seen it. I, it's, I apologize. I have not had like the greatest moments today um we had a sad point where we had to give up uh or my mom had to give up uh some dogs uh the babysitters onyx and caesar so uh still kind of reeling won this battle, Max. from that you broke up my family i salute you david I didn't try to hurt you. Ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe. Too late, isn't it? You just better be damn careful with her. Don't you wander off into the dark. Okay. That was... Intriguing. Catch up to myself, see what the hell I'm missing out on. Poor whales are like beached angels. What is going on here? You? This is absolutely boring. I'll have to read those notes some other time. Stool. Yes, I would like to sit on said stool. Jesus. Jar. A note. What does the note Ouch. say? Oops.
So on top of my family being shattered a little bit, I broke up another family too, and it's been a while since uh, I played, so... You know, there's that. Been too busy with other shit like dead birds. God damn it, this is the second game with dead birds now. I guess David wasn't in the mood to clean up. Uh, great. Donut on the ground? Okay. Okay. It looks like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. Because when all else I fails, I'll help Miss Grant next time. If there is one. Scran has informed me that her petition will only was only one avenue of protest. Oh boy. David is packing up wedding stuff too. Oh, that makes me sad. It was so incredible to see William again. I wish Chloe could too. Oh, look at the note. What the hell did David do for Nathan? And what did his dad do for David? Thank you for your help with Nathan. Oh. Okay. Okay. Lockers. Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that locker. Hey, David, what you hiding? Okay, let's use it. Never mind. For once, I don't have time to search for the code. Oh, I need to find a way to break this padlock. Can't you? Yeah, you can rewind time. So, why say such something, such a stupid thing, and then? Uh. Okay, I can use that crowbar to pry open the locker. Let's go. Let's go. It's not. This game is kind of hard to to use with or. Hard to use, Sorry, David, hard to play. I bet you would do the same thing as me. Without a companion. Oh, maps, notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan. Oh, yes. Oh, what? Directions? Oh, cool. What does it say? Pay up? Score. Back to Chloe now. Uh-oh. Oh, I have a bad feeling about this. It's, the note. it's amazing how much drama this living room has seen. Looks like David already booked a room. Huh, oh, okay. Sure that's not gonna come in handy later. No thanks. Yo, Chloe! Are you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. Kate, Nathan, and Rachel. Plus some location cool. David is like a one-man surveillance army. Now let's get the hell out of here before we get busted. Now let's go find out what Nathan is hiding in his room. We have to be extra careful. Max, now it's time for Nathan Prescott to be afraid of us. How have my situations with stealth gone again? You have to be stealthier than that. Oh yeah, shitty. So I think Yes, get some world building in. People are yes. There's a pay up thing again.
Hey, Max. How you doing? Oh, hi, Mr. Jefferson. I'm okay. Um, and this is my friend, Chloe. Yeah? Chloe? Why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? I was way too cool for the school. It's a long story. And actual files here. I can imagine. Max, are you sure that you're all right? It's weird just being on campus like everything's normal. I know. Lame as it sounds, life has to go on. I think there's too much going on in my life. On that note, Blackwell duty calls. Remember, I'm going to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest tonight at the party. Yeah, so no. I hope you'll be there to celebrate. Even though I'm sorry you didn't enter a photo. I understand your reasons. You can't force an artist to work. I feel like a total loser, but it's been a hard week to focus. No pun intended. I'm proud of you for caring so much about a troubled friend. And I take hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Just get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I'll definitely be there tonight. Me too. I'll be Max's date. You better dance with us at least once. And nobody should have to see me dance. Plus, you don't want to watch the old hipster trying to keep up with the kids. I have some pride. Be seeing you. Yes, you will. Mm. Hot floor teacher. Gross! You are out of control. Not yet. Just wait until the rager tonight. <sighs> Shut up. Don't be jealous because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am so ignoring you. Fine. Since I'm here, I'll see if I can get some dirt from Justin. I haven't talked to him in a while. Now that is a great plan. Let's see if I can find out where Nathan is. What just happened? Ooh. Dick. Justin. I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. Shouldn't be a shocker, you think but you could hide from Max Caulfield, Squirrel Paparazzi. Is that the camera? Yes. I hope Max isn't pissed that Warren asked me to the drive in. Hey Brooke, how are you? Considering what happened to Kate, I could be better. Are you okay? I might feel better taking your drone for a quick flight. Miss Grant caved and let me fly her again. So take a spin. I have to see what time I'm going to the drive-in with Warren on Saturday. Hmm. Oh, uh, he asked you to go to the drive-in with him? Well, uh, that's cool. I love the drive-in in Newburgh. So old school, but so much fun. Like Warren. Dig that knife in! Dig that knife in hard! <clears throat> Sorry. I wonder if this is, like, all I should be paying attention to for the most part. Except that phasing idiot. Thanks. I'll just let you be for a little bit. I feel like the sky wants to yell at us. How are you doing, Max? Been a tough week. I know. Yes, it has, Samuel. How are you? Sad and confused like everybody else in Arcadia Bay. You look like you have a lot of questions, too. Why are you weird like that? Why do you sound like you're gonna murder someone? Just why? More questions than answers. Samuel is always here to talk. Ah. Oh. So we're talking the third person now. Okay, let's talk about Nathan then. Have you seen Nathan Prescott around? That would be hard since he was suspended. You don't sound sad, Samuel. Nathan hurts people. The end. Mm. You really know about him. Not enough to help you, Max. I truly wish I could. I see what you're doing. Do you? 
Okay. I'm just here for info on Nathan. I better get going now. Now, who can I ask? Let's go back to girl who wants to dig that knife that Warren is now dating someone else. Back again, Brooke. Are you sure you're all right? I need to find Nathan. Have you seen him around? I was distracted by Warren asking me out to the drive-in. Knife! Nathan was suspended, but he should still be on campus. I did see him this morning heading off campus. He looked more angry than usual. I wouldn't look for him now if I were you. Okay. I have to go. Talk later, Brooke. Good. Nathan is not around. I should go back to Chloe. Jesus Christ, she is dragging that knife out. Coast is clear. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you could have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ah, oh, you suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja Mode. Speaking of which, how well did that go last time? Oh yeah, not well. It's so lame, they don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. Wait here. Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Now I just have to find Nathan's room. That shouldn't be too hard, right? This can only be Nathan's room. Well, that was obvious. Okay. Now I need to find Nathan's phone or anything with clues. Okay. Cool. Um That monochrome camera is brand new and costs about 6 grand. <sighs> Bastard. Oh, well, there's nothing wrong with you just taking it. Sounds like he's going to only all your energy would it's so damn creepy but the guy has his own style can we turn on the lamp that must be the lamp chloe broke when nathan drugged her oh that is so chloe Oh my god. Chloe. Oh, Chloe. I need to find whatever the fuck I'm looking for and get the fuck out. Like yesterday? Yes, I would be cool with having this high tech projector. Photos. Let's use the computer. Nathan is way into this party. This is strong stuff. Wow. Inexpensive. Kiss ass much, Principal Wells. Okay, so pretty much... Yeah. I'm sorry. Holy shit. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. A gift from... Okay. Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. Cute. I don't think this prescription has helped Nathan. 
scratch marks? What the hell are all those marks on the floor? What am I looking for again? Let's find out what you're hiding. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. Oh! Sneaky. Now I have Nathan's phone, so I can show it to Chloe. Well, before Nathan comes back. Okay, then let's get the fuck out of here. Phone. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So, what did you find? A stalker. The room was clean and creepy. That too. Check this out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. Uh oh. What are you doing in my dorm? You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me ho. Max, I got this. Get the fuck out of my face. Oh, nice. You are so fucking dead. Grab the gun. Grab the gun. Uh, ah, stay out of it. Fuck it. <sighs> you like to hurt people, huh? Like Max? Like Kate? Like me? Huh? Feel this motherfucker? Um, I don't know. I'm, I'm just gonna enjoy this. Grab the gun. Stop. Sorry. Yes, we have to go. Yes, thank you. Finally, someone listened. Who's the bitch now? Chloe. Damn, Warren went full alpha on Nathan. And it was good. But scary. Oh, I... Shit, man. Really hurts. Okay, yeah, I'm leaving that. That was the final decision right there. <laughs> yes. Damn. That was intense. Warren, uh, th thank you so much. For what? For beating the shit out of Nathan Prescott? Dude, you rule. I don't know. I kind of went crazy there. Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So where are you going? I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Not yet. Uh, so maybe you better... Um... Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes, you are. Oh good, he missed the pull. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. I know. He really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Totally worth it. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. Like I said, Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. Wow. Go Nathan.
think I need to finish this episode up. Then I'll be just episode five. We can do that in a two-parter, necessarily. God, I hate seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. I just think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. Well, that asshole is going to help us find Rachel. Or what? You'll actually shoot him? Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. And I might even save you someday. About time. I am so going to hit you. With the gun. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grew up. I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me, and Rachel. Absolutely. So let's play this cool, okay? Just talk to Frank so we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. I can see this going well. I can see this going very well. Okay. Flyer, no. Beach ball. It glowed, so now we have to see Frank all the way out here. Why is he by dead whales? That's what I want to know right now, is why is he by dead whales? Let's get to it. Let's just get to it. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. You hmm. should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? I... I don't have the money. Yet. Oh, really? Then why did you text me that you did? Because I wanted to tell you in person. Oh, I'm truly touched, Chloe. Now why are you losers really here? We just want to ask you some questions. You have some serious lady balls. No. Jesus, okay, okay. But I'm not getting you high. Frank, we're not here to get high. No, you don't look like the type. Not like Chloe here. So what do you hardy boys want? Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? Okay. You don't get it, man. This is for a good cause. No, man. I do not get it. Especially from a weirdo like you. You know, I hate the way you talk to me like you... Like you know more than I do. No, no, I'm not. I... I... Oh, Christ, I hate you, Blackwell. Shit. You expect everything for free. You're not getting any handouts from me. I work for a living, you understand? Yes, Frank. Without those Blackwell shits as customers, you wouldn't have any work at all. Dude, you're a drug dealer. You snobby whores. Don't come into my home and judge me. That's why I go to church. And you want something from me? How about a blade up the ass, huh? I'm sorry, what? down, Frank. Let's just talk. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Get it, bitch? Get it? Step the fuck back now! Pompidou! Oh, that'll work. You fucking killed my dog! Oh my god! 